Hey guys, welcome back to DeadBot 2.0. My name is Brian, and in today's video, I'm going to be going over Amino Asylum. I've had a lot of people ask me where you can buy good PCT products, and so I figured today I would go over Amino Asylum's website, since they do have a pretty good selection. So you can see here on the screen, we have Amino Asylum's homepage up. You can go to the drop down here and go over all the different products, or you can scroll down here and you see there's a different little category for each. I wanted to show you guys real quick. Um, they have some pro hormones. We'll go in there, check those out real quick. They don't have a huge selection, but they do have some. They have Dedral, DMZ, Epiandro. Um, I have that one in my stores. You guys know, and mine's at 400 milligrams of serving, whereas theirs is at 50. Um, Hexadrone and Imstein are available here also. Let's go down to peptides and uh, you can see they have a pretty big selection of peptides. So if you guys are looking for something specific, you can check this out. Like I said, they have a very, very good reputation as far as high quality goes. And so having this available is definitely beneficial. Let's go down here to research chemicals. And they have a whole bunch of stuff in here too, obviously. A bunch of stuff that you don't see in other websites like albuterol and clinbuterol, right? Clomiphene here, letrozole, metformin, prami. So a lot of PCT type products, Tadalafil, T2 and T3, those aren't something you find very often. Zidinophil, Tamoxifen are available here. Let's go down here to research oils. So this is kind of exciting. They have an LGD injectable. This is 10 milligrams, or sorry, 50 milligrams in a 10 mil vial. So you have a full cycle in one vial of an injectable LGD. Pretty sure that's LGD 4033, but it doesn't say. You open it up and it doesn't tell you what it is. They had some other interesting stuff there too. We'll go back and look at it, but see, it doesn't really show you if it's LGD 4033. It might be LGD 3303. I think it would say if it was. Let's see, let's go back here to research oils. They have a Trestolone SR9009. So they have Trestolone and, and then acetate. I can't even talk this morning. And a decanate, which is pretty cool. And also YK11. If you go over here to SARMs, they also have an LGD over here and this one is liquid formula so that's nice to have available like i said i'm not sure if that's lgd 4033 i would assume that it is but it doesn't specify and they have all the other standard SARMs available also now if you go over here to aminos they have a pretty big selection of their own kind of formulations and some of these are pretty cool uh, they have a liver restore they have an l-carnitine injectable so this one has like a blend in it uh let's see here Oh, sorry, that's not a blend. That's just three different dose sizes. So that's nice to have. They have the Monster Blend and they have a Monster Pump Blend. This Monster Pump, pump Blend is something I've actually been wanting to try. Again, it comes back to there's a lot of stuff I want to try, but it's just budget thing. You know, a lot of this stuff, and it adds up quick, as you guys know. So I haven't been able to try a lot of stuff that I would like to. So you look at something like the Monster Pump Blend, and this is an injectable pre-workout, basically, which is kind of cool. They're focusing, obviously, on the pump, right? So you got big pump complex involved in there, something like the Mass Monster Blend. It's got a whole ton of different aminos in there, which is pretty interesting. I'm kind of curious what results a guy would see if you were using this on a regular basis, injecting it, you know, either right before or right after a workout. I'm kind of curious how fast recovery would be improved. Um, they have a relax blend over here, and these are pretty much all injectables as far as I can tell. They have a shredder down here. This one's pretty cool, and a super shredder too. So you got your l team B12, B6, Inositol, so on and so forth. So that would be an interesting one to try rather than something like Carterine, because this would probably be a lot healthier in my opinion. Go over here to sprays, and their sprays are really good. I've used this PT141, very good quality. I see they have a new pepped out now also. I want to try that. It's a cognitive type smart drug so if you guys don't know anything about new pept it's pretty interesting the research on there i actually just ordered a bunch of smart drugs from paradigm peptides so i should be getting those in the mail pretty soon i'll be posting reviews of those smart drugs on my new youtube channel uh, dadbot 2 fit so once that channel is up and live i'll share a link with you guys to the new channel that's going to be the non-ped type supplements you know i won't be talking about SARMs and stuff like that on that channel at least initially. If this channel gets taken down, then I'll move all these videos over to that channel kind of thing. Uh, of course, they have the BPC-157, which is pretty common, TB-500 down here. 
So if you guys are looking for nasal versions of those, go check them out. Once again, if you guys are looking for something specific and you can't find it on their website, you can come over here to my landing page, solo.to slash dadbod2fit, and all the companies that I use, trust, and recommend are on here with discount codes so you guys can save yourself some money and find pretty much anything that you are looking for. So I hope that's beneficial to you guys. Thank you for watching and subscribing. I'll see you in the next video. Take care.